All right, so. I only have seven bullets for this gun. Um, I desperately need to look for other ammo spots. Anything and everything that can give me ammo. And I also, this is, um, this is like my fourth session of the game now, my fourth or fifth session of the game. Um, I desperately need to, um, well, not desperately, it's not really major, but I do want to go back to the crime scene and see if it'll let me, uh, pick up that, uh, that one clue that it didn't let me last time. Probably won't, and I'll probably just have to say screw it and move on, but... Yeah, it seems to have mainly gone away because I guess like you're supposed to technically find this before you go down like further into the uh, like the lake area where the uh, the entrance is in the first place to um, you know the ritual spot. Um, so if I just have to forget it and move on, then oh well. Maybe it's a thing of like where I can revisit it later and pick it up, but pro like I said, probably not because of already like you know the progression we've made. Um, but I do want to look around for, uh, ammo, because I only have seven shots for the handgun, and then two shots for the, uh, the shotgun. So, if I go into this ritual thing and end up needing more ammo than I have, then I'm in a bad spot. So... doesn't hurt to just comb the area real quick for some supplies. I do like the knitting hero, I had it made just for you. Okay. UFOs and you, the ultimate guide to spotting unidentified flying objects. Writing this down in case it happens again and I forget, I got that feeling again. It hit me suddenly at 1.15 a.m. after I'd finished my ama on the porch of the trailer. I got in the car and drove chasing it. Starry night, not much moon, as expected. It led me past Bright Falls to Cauldron Lake. I tried to find the right spot, the right emotion, the right thought. The combination to have it all aligned to make it happen. Terrified it would, it didn't. Not this time, frustrated but relieved. I scanned the sky for sha the shapes, the objects, nothing. But when I blinked repeatedly, I think I saw the after image of an octahedron. Octahedron, sorry. It faded past. When I got ready to drive back, I felt someone watching me. Here, but not here. It's him. I know it is. Does he know I'm getting close? I'm on the right track. I was right to come to Bright Falls. So we're right down here by a... A tent. So it's the uh, tent icon, obviously. Um, stuff there for a second. That was weird. Um, Chem clock here, nice. I only have one battery for the flashlight too, which is also not good. Um, so I gotta do some definite um, searching around before I even think about advancing further in the story. So make sure I'm combing every single spot. I'm pretty sure I've gotten like most of the supplies, but 
doesn't hurt to triple check your surroundings. Of course, there are obviously um, a couple spots that I haven't fully looked at. Like, there's some corner spots that I haven't like really combed. Like, that's a notepad, obviously, so nothing I can do with that. Um, but just speaking in terms of like story-wise, I'm pretty sure I found like everything that I can find story-wise. But We'll just, I don't think it's going to let me go any, uh, too far away from the objective. It's probably going to turn me around if I get too far. So, right now my goal is to just go as far as I can away from the objective. And then if it turns me around, then I'll just have to keep looking in the general vicinity. A lunchbox again. Who's leaving these out here? Remember, it's just a bad day, not a bad life, but if you're having a good day, ignore this whole thing. Okay. That's a good thing I went back this way. Um... I assume the red mark spots mean a dead end, so I can't go any further than that, maybe. Yeah, because that's blocked off, and that's where the, uh, that's where the red spot is. Okay. Um... I think it's gonna make me commit to just doing this ritual with just the amount of ammo I had, which I don't want to do, but it's probably gonna make me do that. Like, like even if I was just to like look at like a guide, uh, which I was trying to do last time for the um. So I still have that page up, like, where it's like, oh, the clue's right here, the clue's right here, and it was supposed to be the footprints that, uh, it wouldn't, like, pick up. Like, yeah, so even if I was just to look at this guide, um, I don't think it's gonna tell me anything else. My only other thing is that I can go into that ritual and use the bullets that I have. Um, because obviously the shotgun's probably going to be stronger in the long run, and I... Uh... I'm just double-checking real quick this. Again, I feel bad that I'm literally using a guide for this, but it's literally, it's so weird how this is... Alright. 
just wanted to scan that uh that index one more time before I uh I commit it to uh going. But wait, whoops, I pressed the wrong side of the touchpad again. Let me just go up to this area one more time. Um see if there's anything extra that I'm missing, like at all. And then if not, then we're just gonna have to commit to going in with seven, well, nine bullets. Um, combine, uh, counting the shotgun and the, uh, the pistol. I had a brain fart there. I was like, what was I trying to say? <laughs> um, yeah, so. Again, let me just comb the area one final time. Checking every single spot that I have been to. Is that, um... Is that question mark icon is point of interest. So that'd be that there, okay. There's another lunchbox. Oh, ha! Huh. Nice. Good thing I came back here. My dad used to say when the going is tough, tough get going. Not sure where the tough get going to, but maybe you'll find it inspiring. I'm pretty sure I found that one. Um, which looks like it didn't save from last time, but that's okay. Um, Cause I remember I had to, I was trying to reload the, uh, the checkpoint to see if it would um, give me back any, uh, like if the uh, the clue that I was trying to find before was glitched, and then that didn't turn out to be the case, just a thing of oh, well you already like went past the clue, so I, I'm pretty sure it's just thing I can't pick up the clue anymore. And I wasted a whole entire episode just looking for that goddamn clue. Well, crafty a whole entire episode, I guess you should say, because it was just being like. It's very weird that it wouldn't let me pick it up, but oh well. Um, thank the freaking gods that I found that. Thank the literal gods that I found that. And that's a dead, this is a dead end too, but wow, okay. It is very good I came down. <laughs> it is very good I went down that path. And it's very good I went down that path. Thank the gods, because I seriously would have probably been screwed if I went into this, uh, this next area without it. Oh my good god, I'm so glad I found that. This every is everything, uh, yeah, okay, I read all that already. Shit. I have an extra battery for the flashlight. I only have the two bullets of the shotgun, but at least I have more pistol ammo, and it's not just a seven shell. So I have 17, uh, I have 17 bullets now for this thing altogether, which is very good and gonna be a very big lifesaver. I've already said it once, but I'm very glad that I found that box. Let me just comb around this area before I start the ritual up. Just to make sure I'm not missing anything. Which I don't think I am. I think we're good to continue. Yeah. All right, here we go. Saga, it's you and me. The wave crashed on the far side of the mirror. I brought you the heart witch. Show me the tower.
Well, the path is definitely open now. Casey, I think I'm in the overlap. Are you still on your way? Casey! Casey, do you need me? Fuck. Nope. Okay, Saga. Going in solo. This should be fun. Be aware of the surroundings. Logan? Logan! Where are you? What the fuck was that? Logan's back in Virginia. You're imagining things. Nothing over there. around what the no this is right this place is looping like a nightmare <sighs> need to find nightingale Nightingale enters the lake. The writer went into the lake, banished the dark presence. Taken still lurked in the woods. The dark place receded. The current pulled back those with darkness inside. Into the lake. Nightingale was there. One of them. The dark presence. Jagger had taken him. The witch had stolen his heart. They sank beneath the waves. The dark place. Wandering in the shadows, muttering to themselves. It's dark. I'm lost. Where am I? Who am I? I can't remember. It's cold. Premium cabins for rent in Bright Falls. Who said that? Can you hear me? I need help. Please, stop this. What did I do? You must dig it out. Their shape shifted, echoes of the writer's dreams, fading in, fading out. The next story and the story after that, the writer was writing again. Huh. I don't have enough to upgrade anything, do I? No, I still need a... Yeah, okay. I still need some fragments to upgrade stuff. This isn't good. This ain't good. Okay, then maybe jump a little bit. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Nightingale. 
probably look around here real quick just to make sure I'm not missing anything. Okay, no, so I... Alright, so I came from there, so I just went backwards, so I gotta go back down here. I just don't want to miss, like... Oh wait, shit. The cult symbols. I just don't want to miss like any like. Ha. Nightingale in the dark place. He'd been on the trail of the writer forever. The writer he despised. Hemingway, Bukowski, Wake. I'll get you. I'll find you. I'll make you pay. You're in over your head. He descended into the tunnels, from the dark city, into the ocean of darkness. Next stop, Caldera Street Station. Something, a presence, rumbled. Not a train. Shadows shifted on the platform. The writer's cult waited for him there. The cult of the word. A cultist leaned close. I carry his words close to my chest now. You're not allowed in the lake until he says otherwise. He'd be caught. Murdered. They got him. They didn't get him. He was reborn out of hate. He was there. But he was risen. Sent to find the light switch up from the lake that was not the lake. Huh. Interesting. Um... Just want to make sure... Again, I want to make sure we find, like, any and all collectibles, or, like, ammo and stuff, so... I believe we've pretty much like found everything so far, but yeah, cause that goes back up to the top. Okay. Better safe than sorry. I just don't want to get into like, uh, engaged in combat and then end up in a point where I'm completely screwed. As I've said before, before I even did this. Um, nothing here in the little, uh, ledge before you hop down either. Okay. Trapped here. Who escaped? Danger. Who is that? It's like they're coming in over a bad signal. Is that Alan trying to get through? I'm pretty sure it is. Unless it's Mr. Scratch. Or anti Allen, if you want to call him that. <laughs> I keep seeing these glimpses of like the other, uh, like, it keeps showing these glimpses of the other world. Um, so is that supposed to be like a hint towards like. Nightingale's badge. Nice. A trauma kit. Batteries, so we have ammo. Nice, 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 nice. So 
So it's not let me pick up that badge, I guess not. And then nothing to do on that end. Okay. Um, we can't go down either. Okay, so we just gotta go upwards. All right. Which reminds me, it's a good thing that. Should probably use this trauma kit. I just noticed my health is kind of like down a bit. Good thing I did that before I started anything else. And we have three batteries now, which is very good. Feels like we're going into like a subway tunnel. Well, it's even like a stage almost. Game on, asshole. Oh, damn. This is not how the story goes. Alright, so it's just two shots with a shotgun. Okay. So... I'm curious when I'm supposed to... I mean, obviously trial and error will uh, help me figure it out. I'm curious what I'm supposed to do here. <laughs> maybe it's the thing of, like, I gotta, like, uh, get back in between the rock, maybe. Shit. There we go. Ammo, thank you. Let me reload. Oh, hi. I thought every time I shoot the shotgun at him, he vanishes. It's like the shotgun's his kryptonite. 
Which reminds me. Um, should probably heal. Again? Oh, damn. Asshole. Again? Yeah, but I'm going to need you to not choke me off for like five seconds. Shit, 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 Well, at least I'm getting the hang of what I'm supposed to do. I just hope it checkpointed me after. <laughs> nope. Started me at the very beginning of the encounter again. God damn it. Well, at least I know what I'm supposed to do. I have to run away from him when he starts net charging. Okay. All right. Oh shit. I play with demo resources. the second he charged me too. That's that end. Okay. Damn, I got so many shells for the freaking shotgun, too. Got him. Who are you? Yep, it's Alan. Did Lake just dry up? Hey. Are you okay? No, no, it's my fault. They got out. 
What the shit? My face! Scratch! Yep. Sir, calm down. I'm gonna need you to take a breath. He's... He's changed the story. The, the dark presence. We must stop it before... Easy now. First things first. What's your name? My name is Alan Wake. I'm a writer. I, I've been... Wake? Where did you come from? You've been missing for 13 years. 13. Holy damn. Holy damn. That if that is not the best way to end the chapter. Let me get like um made a promise that I'm coming out alive. Rage and heart when too far. The song that kind of like describes the uh the events of the story so far. I was I'm really sure I said hell way to end the chapter before uh, like in the last episode, but literally like wow, this is an incredible game so far. Alright, I'm vibing. <laughs> I don't know if those are copyrighted or not, so I'm just going to keep going. <laughs> Where did you go? All of a sudden, the radio stopped working, and then that flooding just disappeared. The crazy forest. Is this who I think it is? Casey, say hello to Alan Wake. Mr. Wake, this is Special Agent Alex Casey. He'll escort you to our car. Casey, I'll meet you there right after I take a look around. If the floodings receded, there might be evidence we missed earlier. Okay. So, like... See you there. Now the question stands, like... So, he said Scratch got out and released the Dark Presence, but... Now I'm starting to theorize, is this Scratch posing as Alan Wake in order to release the Dark Presence, or is this actually Alan Wake and the Dark Presence was released by Scratch? You know what I mean? Like, maybe it's like a, a thing of like where it's a whole, like, ploy just to get like saga um just to get to uh like a destination point to release the dark presence but it probably is the actual alan wake and i'm probably just overthinking this whole entire thing but investigate the previously oh, flooded area and then Power. take the car back to bright falls am i still is this the dark place no it can't be i got out should look around with the flooding gone could be further clues out there. The flooding disappeared very suddenly. I wonder if there's any connection to the overlap to Nightingale. I'm curious about Casey too, because like, if he conveniently happens to share the same name as a uh, as the character in Alan's story. Then is it a thing? Like, obviously, there's a lot of people that uh, share similar names, but like, you have a flashlight? It's not safe without... I have so many questions right now. <laughs> a light and a gun. You can relax, Wake. And pages. If you see pages of writing anywhere, you must take them and keep them safe. Our lives depend on it. Um.
the cult is leaving supplies around for themselves. Nice little, like, Simon keypad. Is that a flare? Nice. And more inventory space. Nice. And we got a clue. Is that, um... Wait. What's the note say? The cult doesn't see their victims as people. Remember, they look like us, but they aren't. They're like animals, and it's our job to hunt them and gut them. All right, so we found that. Um, what I'm curious about is if we go back to the crime scene, if it's gonna let me get that um, that one clue again, because it, it's still showing like I can pick something up there, but it's just not letting me pick it up. I'm going to turn back around real quick and go back down to the uh, the shoreline. It says it's optional, and I know we found that chest, but just to be on the safe side, I want to make sure there's nothing else that we're missing here. I guess they're still standing here. All the trees are collapsing and everything around here too, it's crazy. But it's glad to see the, um, it's nice to see the story starting to slowly unfold. There's more to investigate here. Well, there's extra stuff we can add to the case board now. Um, what does it say? No reminding cultists that victims are like animals. Let's go cult psychology. And then murder at Cauldron Lake. We have a clue for the main case. Case closed. Nightingale goes missing for 13 years, shows up murdered, and then turns into a monster. After I stop Nightingale, a rider who's also been missing for 13 years turns up. What's the connection? What kind of case is this? I killed Nightingale. I had to. He was a monster. The flooding around Cauldron Lake receded afterward. Nothing about this makes rational sense. We found Alan Wake, a rider... Uh, huh? 
We found Alan Lake, a writer missing for 13 years at the shores of the lake. Hopefully he can shed some light on this. Found some more Alex Casey lunchboxes. Lunchbox found near the Cauldron Lake campground. Lunchbox near the Waterfall Vista at Cauldron Lake. Lunchbox found near a landslide at Cauldron Lake. Okay. Found the Colt stash at the Cauldron Lake shore. Okay. That's everything installed there. So they obviously want us to uh, go back to the car and stuff, but just to be safe, I want to look around just a little bit more here. Just to make sure I'm not missing anything of importance. That could be pertinent to uh, any of the cases. I like it though. Like I, I really like the uh, the two like the branching stories. It seems like they're going for here right now. You have a uh, Alan story. Obviously, I'm pretty sure it's going to be of his time in the dark place. And then you have a saga story of how she's just like this simple FBI agent. And then now she's getting pulled into this larger, like, spindle of events. I'm not seeing anything else here, at least... As far as I'm noticing. Because, like, the goals are investigate the previously flooded area. The previously flooded area was, of course, the, um, where Alan surfaced back at. So. I don't know. I feel, I feel like we're... Because the only thing over here was that stash, right? Nothing else aside from the stash. Like, I don't think I can get over there. But now we have stashes, like an extra, like, uh, thing to look for. Loaded here just in case we come across an encounter. Oh, just move on. Oh, this is the okay. Why are you little? Even the animal. 
also turning into monsters. Okay, so the oh, got it. Okay, this is the previously flooded area. Got it. 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 Dream sides dash K. Side a cauldron lake. There's something written here. A poem? Or One a bird for light, two for darkness, three birds for a fight, four for a struggle, five birds for injury, six for misery, seven for the ending, whatever it may be. Spindle. Perfect weird souvenir for Logan. What were they recording their uh their sacrifices? That's what it seems like. find a, a key for this Let's find your station I find a key for this one too the hell wait well, started me all the way back here too I mean, the good news is that it saved me there, so...
manuscript page. Pick up the key again. Okay, so original way is blocked off, so we gotta go a completely different way. Oh, okay, that makes sense now. Er. That's a... Okay. Cool, my save spot here. Alright. Cool. Save up again real quick. All right, onwards and upwards.